Okay. Um, package received through the post. Let's have a look see what we've got in there. <coughs> we've got um, the new Red Dragon catalogue. Nice glossy catalogue as ever. And in there I presume there will be uh, prepaid envelope. And we've got this time, this we've got um, some Steve Beaton 24 gram darts. And let's get inside these. <coughs> okay. Um, we've got a nice trifold wallet. Inside the wallet, we've got a set of nice golden kite designs, Red Dragon. Some plain black kites. We've got a spare set of aluminium shafts. Uh, and we've got the darts themselves. Let's have a look at these. <clears throat> okay, now these are interesting. Um, for a start, on here. That says, it's got the, I don't know if you can see that or not, but on there, it's got laser etched, um, the Red Dragon logo. We've got a series of fairly shallow cut grooves um, with colour applied to the base of them. So we've got black and yellow and what have you. That front section is completely smooth. Then in the middle there, you can hear that. That's micro grooved. Interesting. And at the back, we've got some uh, normal, fairly fine grooves. This part of the barrel is, is straight, and then we've got over just a small taper towards the rear. These are the 24 gram darts. Oh, it's true. Um, the, the points on these, as you can see, are knurled. So we've got a, a standard length stainless steel point with knurling there. I would suggest that's more for uh, the feel on your finger than it is for actual grip in the board. Um, aluminium shafts again. Um, there you go, there's your 90% tungsten. These are 24 gram uh, Steve Beaton darts. Very nice thing too. They are to get out the, the little plastic holder because of the knurling on the actual um, points themselves. Um, grip wise, um, yeah, I would, it, first impressions, I would put that, well there's no grip at the front, then we've got that really nice micro grip which I would classify as maybe a level three. Then we've got this slightly coarser grip. Um, so overall I would say a level three grip. Um, like I say, no grip there on that, it's completely smooth. A few simple grooves there, add a little bit to the actual feel of the dart. In the centre we've got the micro grooves which is a really nice thing to grab hold of and then at the back we've got these slightly coarser grooves. So there, quite a nice looking thing, quite a nice feeling dart. Yeah, there you go, this is what you get for your money. Your set of darts, your uh, trifold wallet, your little plastic block for your stems to fit into, a set of golden kite shaped flights, a spare set of shafts, a set of black kite shaped flights. Let's have a quick measure of the things to see what we're looking at. Um, at the fattest part of the dart, we are looking at 6.9 millimetres, 6.8 millimetres. At the rear, where it tapers down, that goes down to around about 5.6 millimetres. The overall length of the dart, of the barrel itself, is in the order of 45.7 millimetres. And as, as ever, 
if I compare that to my standard dart, which is a Taylor Purist, and just put the two together, you can actually see and compare the difference between the two darts. Okay, so there you go. There's your your Steve Beaton 24 gram 90% tungsten dart from Red Dragon. This is what you get for your money. Your case, your darts, your two sets of flights, your two sets of shafts, your little plastic block for holding the darts in. Um, yeah, looks like a nice piece of kit. I'm quite looking forward to these. Interesting with that uh, little bit of micro groove in the middle there. So, let's see how they fly. Okay, just going to have a few throws with these darts. First thing you've got to say is, a 90% tungsten dart, very nicely made, very nice quality, all the kit, less than 20 quid at the minute, that's, that's good value in anybody's book. They feel, they feel really comfortable, uh, fit into your hand really nicely, really nicely. Um, that little bit of micro grooving. That that just fits on my thumb. The way I hold the dart, it just just sort of like rolls in there really nicely, really sweetly. So I've got to say that these darts feel really comfortable. They fly very nicely. They feel very well balanced. Uh, yeah, a good dart. And. Uh, I've been throwing them now for about five minutes. I'm really enjoying it, to be honest. They're, uh, they're, they're comfortable dart. They're, they're a little bit uh, shorter than what I normally throw, but that's not to the detriment. Uh, they feel very comfortable. Um, they, f they fly very nicely. They're, they're good quality. The grip's nice. The feel of the thing. I mean, for me, um, being able to feel the dart and in your hand and how it fits on your thumb for me is, is absolutely vital and these they just sort of like sit there really nicely uh, making them fairly easy to throw if that makes any sense a nice comfortable dart so uh, well for my recommendation yes quality dart So there you go, there's your, your Steve Beaton. In this case, these are the 24 gram darts. I believe Steve uses 22 gram darts of, the, of exactly the same style. Um, but these are the, these are the 24, 24 gram flavour. Um, beautifully made as ever. Uh, well packaged. You get your two sets of flights, your two sets of shafts, your wallet, the whole nine yards. So you can just, uh, just get your darts out of the post, go out and play darts. Yep, good quality. Um, a good a good buy. Another ten out of ten from me.